Airbus plans to create a fleet of self-flying taxis have moved a step closer, thanks to the first successful test flight of a full-scale prototype. Project Vihana's aircraft, dubbed Alpha-1, took to the skies for the first time, flying for a total of 53 seconds. With further testing, the firm hopes to have a commercial version of the craft in operation by 2020. Scroll down for video. The test flights took place at the Pendleton Unmanned Aerial Systems Range in Oregon, close to a nearby airport where the craft has been stored since November 2017. Alpha-1 climbed to a height of 16 feet, 5 meters, before successfully returning to the ground at 8.52 a.m. pt, 11.52 a.m. ET, 4.52 p.m. GMT, on Wednesday, before a second test run on Thursday. The self-piloted aircraft is 20.3 feet, 6.2 meters, wide, 18.7 feet, 5.7 meters, long, 9.2 feet, 2.8 meters, tall and is a takeoff weight of 1,642 pounds, 745 kilograms. Future tests will transition from hovering off the ground to directional flight. If successful, they could lead to the creation of commercial self-flying taxis to help commuters avoid the ever-growing issue of traffic during rush hour in congested cities across the world. In a written statement Zach Levering, project executive of Vahana, said, Today marks a historic day for Airbus, A-Cubed, and the Vahana team. After two years of planning and building, we are thrilled to see our efforts culminate in successful flight. Getting Vihana to this point, and at this pace, has tested our ingenuity and our resolve. Tomorrow we'll start on the next steps of our journey. Bahana's sleek self-flying aircraft seats one passenger under a canopy that retracts in similar way to a motorcycle helmet visor. The vehicle is designed to operate like a helicopter. The vertical takeoff landing, VTOL, all-electric aircraft is made up of a cockpit mounted on a sled, flanked by propellers in front and back. Project Vihana began early in 2016 and is one of the first projects at A-Cubed, the advanced projects and partnerships outpost of Airbus Group in Silicon Valley. About the successful test flight, Mr. Lovering added, our aim has long been to design and build a single-passenger electric VTOL self-piloted aircraft that will answer the growing need for urban mobility. Our goal is to democratize personal flight by leveraging the latest technologies such as electric propulsion, energy storage, and machine vision. Our first flights mark a huge milestone for Vahana as well as the global pursuit of urban air mobility. In June 2017, Bahana released a concept video showing what passengers could expect from a future flying taxi service. The two-minute clip depicts Debra, a computer-generated character who needs to get from the Hotel de Anza in San Jose to Yerba Buena Gardens in San Francisco. Rather than content with traffic on the ground, she orders a Vahana flying vehicle to pick her up from the nearest port using a smartphone app. Vahana collects her and completes the 42-mile, 68 kilometers, journey in 18 minutes, 
for a total fare of £77.54. The footage also shows off some of the anticipated features of the vehicles, including automated obstacle avoidance and onboard climate control.